Hey guys, Adam here again, and we're doing some bending today, so I thought I'd show you another cool little tech tip. I'm bending a bunch of odd shaped parts, and I've got the roll of E tooling set up in the Tommy press brake. Uh, this is from Fab Supply. And then I've also got the Trinity Fabworks laser gauge in here. So what I've got is I've got these parts here that I need to bend and they don't have a, a flat surface to gauge off of. So I put these stitch lines in. It, it gives me a, a quick way to line the part up. I know I can make some break off tabs or make a fixture, but I've already got this, this uh, job programmed. I do it on repeat uh, once a year or so. And uh, works well, you just weld these up when we're done. But what's nice is with the roll of E, you get no deformation all the way out to that point. So that's something you're not gonna get with with traditional V die. So with this traditional V die, what you see is out here, there's no support for the bend. So what'll happen when you use a regular V die is this will deform out here. But with the roll of V, it puts constant pressure just by how the dies work. And it puts pressure up as it goes and you get nice, nice bends all the way to the point. So I'll show you that here right now. And then Cody's laser gauge, you just adjust these, these little dials here. And then you line the laser right up with the center of your punch and lower die. And then you can just visually position those parts, those odd shaped parts, or maybe your bump bending parts. And uh, yeah, I'll sit down, we'll put the bend in this. So as you can see, nice and clean, no deformation, beautiful part. Also no bend lines from the V. So that's cool. And then another, another nice feature is say, say this little part like this. If I tried to, to bend this in traditional tooling, it wouldn't have any support right here and it would deform on this round. So the V die or the, the roll of V die puts pressure all the way out to that bend line. So I get a nice clean bend on this very short flange with a, with a radius cut really close to the flange in 3 16 So that works out really cool. So that's, uh, that's two really nice little tips for you. Hopefully that helps. I also have, uh, I have a 10% off discount code. I'll put the link and everything in for, uh, for Fab Supply. You can get precision ground tooling and some other toys and get like 10% off with my last name. And uh, I'll put all that in the description. And I'll also put a link to, to Trinity Fabworks laser gauge in there. So happy bending. Hope you guys have a great day. Hope you have a great weekend. Bye. <laughs>